Hey YouTubers, Farm Boy Reef here. So on today's episode is uh, finishing two tanks from start to finish. So this is gonna be episode three. Uh, I'm gonna do a little mini series going on here. So what I got going on is I actually got two 20 gallon tanks that I wanna put on both sides, each of my display tank here. And my plan is to put a mangrove in each one and then we're gonna let the kids pick whatever they want for each tank. So the mangroves will help filter my main display and the refugium and everything else that's going on. So what I wanna show you guys today is how to build uh, a, a, a tank stand from start to finish plus you know you're drilling your aquarium um, trimming it making it look good I want to build uh, my tank so they they blend into my tank so it just looks like one so that's the plan so we're gonna we got measure tape we're gonna take some uh, measurements of the area I have here I know I can fit a 20 gallon tank on both sides but we need to take the measurements to see what materials we're gonna need um, and measure it up so we make everything look good so it matches the tank so that's the plan today guys so we're gonna, I'm gonna go ahead, we're gonna make some measurements, we're gonna cut some wood, and we're gonna try to build these stands. We'll start with the, the stand on the right first today, and then we'll end up doing the one on the left. So all I wanna do is get one tank built, up and running and going, and then we'll do the other tank. This way we stay focused on one tank, we get one tank all built, you know, light, set up, running, you know what I mean, getting all ready for us to put, you know, live sand, live rock, and then eventually we'll get a light on there, get the mangrove in there, and get some coral and uh, start that tank right off from scratch. And then we'll move on to the next tank. All right, guys, so let's start building the first tank. Let's get some measurements. We're gonna cut up some uh, lumber and get it framed up and go from there. All right, guys, so this is the area I have here. Um, if we measure this out, we have 22 and a half inches here to play with. And this tank, this is the tank from the previous uh, video that I showed you how to, to drill it, put an overflow, uh, overflow box in it, and uh, paint the, uh, the back black, just like my main display so everything matches. Yeah, so this tank, uh, uh, the length on it is 20. So I have a couple inches, uh, an inch like on each side to play with, so it gives lots of room. So this is the tank, guys, and this is the area we have here to work with. So this is where I want to put the stand, put some shelves in here, you know what I mean? So we can put, uh, you know, magazines, food, or whatever, and all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna measure this up, and then we're gonna go outside. We're gonna cut up some wood and some lumber, and we're gonna frame this all in so we can set up our tank. All right, guys. All right guys, so I got the measurements we need. So let's go outside right now and uh, we'll cut up the lumber to the sizes that we need. All right guys? All right guys, so I got my measurements right now. So right now I'm gonna build the, the base of the tank. Um, I need two pieces are actually uh, 21 inches. So I'm gonna measure those up. Never is always good, wear some safety glasses. So let's measure these up. So 21, I got the dual cut saw so we can get some straight cuts. So we need two of them at 21. So let's go ahead and cut this up. We got one at 21. We got the second one here, measure it out. 21. All right, we got two cut at 21. I'm gonna make sure everything fits perfectly on that. All right, I got all the keys, uh, all the pieces cut up right now, so I'm just starting to frame it up. So, because I live in a farmhouse, all the floors aren't completely level. So what I have to do is I have to build a base, and then I have to square and level everything up as I go, because I want everything to be, you know, level plumb square. So I have to build my base first and then build everything on top of that so everything squares up as level. I don't want a fish tank that's all on a mean angle. So that's what I'm doing right now. I got everything ready to go, so I'll frame her up there now. All right guys, it's really coming along there right now. So I got I got the front frame, the back frame. So I just got a few more screws and then I got to measure the size of the cabinet door we're going to put on here. All right guys, so I got it framed up. I'm just gonna frame a couple spots so we can uh, put some shelves, you know what I mean? Just for food and stuff. Um, so it's getting really solid. I tied it into my main display. Um, so now I'm just gonna add the spots where we're gonna put the shelf and then we're gonna see how the, fit, uh, how the tank fits. And then on the next episode, we're gonna paint it all up and we're gonna do some plumbing and stuff. So 
We almost got it, almost got it all done framed here. It's going so really well. We want well. to measure where our shelves go. So I, I put my first one at the same height. So what we want to do is we want to measure off both sides. So 25. We want to mark our 25 so we can put our uh, our hangers. Put our hang for our shelves. So that's the plan. And I'm just gonna put like two shelves, like my uh, main display tank here as well. So then what I'm gonna do is I got the pieces all pre-cut. So I'm gonna put it here, and then this will help. Uh, this will help tie everything in and uh, tie it in together. It'll be really solid. So we're gonna have one shelf here, and we'll have one shelf here. So and plus I want to be able to access in behind here to do plumbing and stuff. So I want these shelves to be able to come out so I can crawl in and out of here. All right, guys. So uh, I got the tank here installed. You guys can see it's solid. Um, I got everything nice. Nice and level, and everything's plumb and square, so we're good. So there's there's the first uh, 20 gallon nano, what it's gonna look like. Um, so then I'm gonna put my shelving in here, in the bottom, guys, and then I'm gonna end up having a light hang, so over the mangroves and all the little uh, coral for eggs and stuff we're gonna have in here with the live rock and set this up. It's a whole brand new system. So I'll bring you guys in a little closer here and check go. it so out. So it's all framed up. You can see. I got the tank here, it's 20 gallon. Um, from my last video, showed you how to drill a hole through glass so we can plumb it up. So we're gonna go down into the basement, into my basement sump, this will run downstairs when we go to plumb that all up. And uh, you guys can see how I painted the, the back of the tank. This is the same to match my tank, display tank. So there you go guys, so there's the tank, there's the build so far, number one. So we just have to do the same thing on the other side. But it's solid, she's good to go, she's not going anywhere. So $14, you got yourself a nice solid cabin. And then these are the doors right here. Like I got from uh, from Ikea on hinges, do the same here. And then I'm gonna put up uh, another piece of trim. It's gonna go right across here and down the sides. So my tank will look like one, just all, so we'll have all uh, three tanks, make them all look like one. And then have the light hanging over the mangroves, live rock, sand, coral, nano, it's a little smaller fish. Maybe some, uh, some gobies, different things like that. Maybe a carpet and enemy. Who knows? So here we go, guys. So there's the first tank. All right, guys. So that one pretty smooth. So we got the we got the 20 gallon nano mangrove, gonna be reef tank all set up. We got our first one built. You know, we got her framed up here for some shelves so I can still access the back and be able to take it apart. And then we'll just get her and get our Ikea door on there. And then we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So it's gonna be a match, matching. Everything's gonna be symmetrical, you know, level plumb square. So we're good to go. So. I hope you guys like this episode. That's the first build. Um, if you guys have any questions or if you guys have any, what you guys want to see go in these tanks, let me know. I'd be more than happy to try to see what we can put in them. So I hope you guys like it. Uh, please subscribe, hit the like button. Um, hopefully uh, next week we'll start on, uh, we're going to paint it up, get it all plumbed up there. We'll get this first tank built first, get it working and nice system. And then we're going to go on to the next tank and get it going. So, you know, thanks for watching guys. So we'll go on to the next one. Bye.